Hi everyone, today I would like to show you how to use the GP jacks in the cafe using my small side series. This is a, a large flat white. So we're going to use a 420 mils. So we're going to make a large flat white using only 420 mils because 600 mils you will have milk left over. You can see that the meals are finished exactly match and no vegetables. As you can see that the 420 meals fit the cup perfectly with the 12 ounce okay, cup. Let's try the candles for 20 meals. We will also 400 meals and fit large. So the next one, I will show you the last so coffee with 400 meals, a candle. It's also and again, fit it will perfectly. Fit. Perfect. Just below. Yeah, just below. Above. Oh, okay. Yeah, if one it's or two on, yeah, 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 one or two on, below yeah. the spout. Okay. If it add on, so at the middle, but this is a uh, this I use a running 380 mils to make a 6 ounce cup and I pour milk a little bit less as my cup is 6 but not 8 ounces. This is how I made it to use different size of the GP jacks to fit different size of the cup for the sealer waste or less milk waste for the cafe. So the next one, I'm going to make two dines coffee. The cup is about 5 to 6 ounces. I will use only 420 ml jugs to make two coffees. See, I already put the milk at the half of the jugs. We can make two coffees. As long as your cup size is about five to six ounces, that will be fit perfect. Warm it up. Okay. Now I'm gonna spit the milk to the other jugs, but I always suggest to warm it first to keep the temperature as hot as we want. I pour first. The cappuccino cup because it has more foam. And I'll put a second cup can be latte or flat white. With a flat white or latte. So now make this one. As you can see, the milk so, still left over, not much. Alright everyone, thanks for watching. Bye!